Now we are going to discuss about how to generate a program from an MAP query. So in the previous tutorial we just pro provided in the previous section, we provided how we created this MAP query. Now to generate it, it's pretty easy. You go to edit. So first of all, you are in this section. Okay, so let's go back. And we go to SQVI okay, and then we go to a quick view additional function generate program so the moment we do that the program gets generated now you say where is the program name I don't know so how you know it you will go to additional function and display report name so then you get a pop-up with the program name okay so so once the program name gets generated, it's it's going it's going to show. Okay. So here, this is the program name that got generated. Make sure you take all these dash dash or equal to sign after that because that's the program name. Okay. So now you go to Control C, you copy it. Okay. And then I'll create a new session. Okay. And now I go to SE38. Okay. And I'll just put this and I'll execute. Guess what? I got my program name. So you can easily use this and create a new transaction code, or you can give it to another person so that he you can use your query. And uh, this, so this way you don't need to worry about. So if at all you want to move it through a transaction code, you can create this in dev. Or if you have access in production SE38, you can execute this transaction code and you can move it to multiple person and they can use this report over and over again in the web query. So this is the, this this portion dealt with how to generate the program, how to display the program name, and then how to execute it. So again, just we will just execute this uh, this query and gives it gives us all the information that we needed for